Hey guys, Avid Endorsman here, and welcome back to another Let's Play episode. I am pretty excited for this episode. Um, one, because I found out how to sort my things, which is pretty nice. Always a nice thing. And two, I got a new sword. This is one we got a few episodes ago, and I got this one while I was finishing up using my bait and doing some quests for the fishing fishing guy the fishing boy guy I guess I don't know but um but yeah um I also killed the eye of Cthulhu a few more times and got the eye of Cthulhu mask um got some more demonite bars I made it into or well I upgraded our uh, axe and our bow if you guys didn't know, I also got this uh, Reaver Shark. I kind of, I kind of said I got it in the last episode, but I didn't really show it off. But um, it looks pretty ridiculous, like this. It looks <laughs> pretty crazy. It actually, does a lot of damage. But um, yeah, uh, it helps us mine a lot faster than the other one. Even our gold, it's twice as fast as gold. This is pretty nice. Definitely something you should pick up in the early game. We got some new statues. I kind of went in the jungle a little bit just to kind of explore, see what it was like. Um, and that's about it, really. Um, I think the reason I am uh, excited for this episode is we will be fighting Skeletron. And I've set up the arena for him. But uh, first, we need to look for a new weapon. And I'll be showing you guys what weapon that is when we come back. Be right back. Alright guys, so I'm back. And the weapon we need is going to be the water bolt. But to do this, we are going to need uh, first a bed. <laughs> Would help. So we need to make a door. Door, slap that on, set our spot here, and we're gonna see if we can find the water bolt before we get owned by the Dungeon Guardian. Let's see if we can find it. We have enough space. Okay, hmm. let's try this out. Hopefully, I already cleared out this one right here, but I didn't go any farther than that. I'm not exactly sure how far you can go into here without the guy annihilating you. Uh, I can feel him coming soon. I want the water bowl. Give me the water bowl, please. He wasn't here. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, is that it? No. Nope. Yeah, it spawns on this bookshelf sometimes. Oh god. Okay. That's not him. <laughs> hmm. Okay, we can try a few more times for sure. And I have no idea how to speed up that, um, what do you call it? That death screen. So if you guys could tell me, it would be pretty awesome. Otherwise, you just have to wait, which is kind of annoying too. Okay. No use healing. We'll just move on. Go a little bit faster this time. Maybe oh my gosh. Hmm. We not might not be able to do this. Hmm. I mean, we could definitely do it without water bolt. But um, hmm. that'd be risky. That'd be tricky. But I think we'll do it anyway. Okay. So. Yeah, I'll see you guys back in a bit, and we'll be ready to fight Skeletron, or at least attempt to fight him. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright guys, we're back, and almost ready to fight the Skeletron boss. Um, I have a few potions, and I want this guy to stay over here, so when he spawns it'll be a little easier. Something like this. There we go. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, or don't, you know. 
or not. Okay, might be ready. No idea. No, not yet. Not yet. Should be close. Um, definitely want to start. Stuff. Definitely need a swiftness potion. Um, because we don't have any movement speed stuff. So yeah, should be ready. No, nope. God, come on, man. Let me cure your curse. <clears throat> there we go. Okay, we're ready. Ooh, okay. We're gonna take out one of his hands first, I think. This, I have no idea how hard this guy has been. Wow, this feather fall potion is. Oh my god, he like bitch slaps me from like a mile away. <laughs> Doesn't really care about distance, does he? Jeez. The biggest thing is getting rid of at least one of his hands. So, uh, I'm gonna focus on one of them. Or whatever we can do. Uh, oh my gosh. That is way too much damage right now. Can't be taking that much damage. That. That. Ow. Not bad. Ow. Ow. Do not want to get hit by his head. That's for sure. Ow. <laughs> As I run right into it. No. Okay. Take that. Take that. Some of that. Some of this. Oh, he just got one of his hands down. The sail is pretty nice because it pierces, so... Ooh, holy crap. Nice, we got one. Now it's a lot easier. Ow. Whoa. I don't want a high five from you, man. The damn farm hand. Holy crap. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Oh yeah, I'm sorry if I'm like sniffling a little bit. I'm a little cold. Or I have a little cold. Little bug. Sorry about that. I thought I'd upload anyway because I can't I just can't resist this game. It's amazing. Oh, this blocks are kinda of messing me up. The Featherfall potion is amazing on this boss. I'm not even joking. It allows me to jump through multiple platforms and dodge a lot easier, so <clears throat> definitely consider that a tip for killing Skeletron. Featherfall potion all the way, for sure. I usually use it with a gravitation potion, but I know the gravitation potion is a little bit different in this game. I'll probably damage him just with our uh, sword as well, but I'm not gonna choose it. I think we're doing okay now. Maybe I'll switch. And my hotkey for that is like really annoying. I know it's gonna be annoying, but I'll switch it in a little bit. I forgot to switch it before this fight. It's J, and uh, that's like really hard for me to hit. Unless I look down the keyboard so I can't just hit it normally. So yeah. I'm right handed. I have my right hand on the keyboard, so my key bindings are a lot different than most people's. I just need to remap my stuff. Oh my gosh. There we go. I think we got this guy. 2400 health. Each hit does approximately 14 damage. That's what I've been seeing as an average. Maybe 13. Yeah, it's about 13. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Um, the first time I ever took on Skeletron in Terraria on Xbox, a, a shooting star finished him off for me. It was quite amazing. I, <laughs> I didn't, I had no idea that they can actually harm bosses. Or you, even. I've had one fall on me before. 
1,600 damage. Okay. 22 crit, oh yeah, that's amazing. This bow, this demon bow is working out pretty well for us. As long as we can keep this. It's about all Terraria is a bunch of rhythm fighting techniques, which I need to brush back up on. Pretty terrible compared to how good I normally do. Okay. Good. We need to get the mini shark, is what we need to get. That'd be pretty awesome. We need to get the arm stealer, though, and I think we need to go for the corruption with that. With that. Yeah. What? very many, but you know, might as well use them. Plus they go a lot faster. Oh yeah! We didn't get anything from him, holy crap. Wow, we were really unlucky. I definitely want to come back and do the trophy again, that's for sure. I might do it off cam, um, but I will get it, that's for sure. I might do it on cam, depends what you guys want really. arrows but the big thing about this is we need the water bolt that's what we wanted I think in the next episode I'm gonna take on the queen bee that'd be pretty awesome because we need that summoning armor that would help out a lot okay what's in here oh yeah that's right uh loot all just take all that <clears throat> Hmm. Got a cross statue. No idea what that does. I forgot what was it? Oh! <laughs> cross statue. It's my gravestone. That's right. Wait. God. What's that? Gel? Okay. Okay. So I got that. And there's another. Okay, still no book. I know it looks different. It looks like this, almost, but not that, as you can see. Ow, spikes hurt. Oh, we got a golden key, let's see. How much damage does this do? 16 melee damage, that's not bad. You can basically use that as your melee weapon. If you get that early on, because that was almost that's almost as good as my uh, yeah, that's as good as my bone um, sword. It's pretty damn good. I do need quite a bit of uh, bait to get it though. But um, if you get fireflies, which spawn I think at midnight on everyone's world, then I still have just arrows, and yeah, we'll use them. We only have like 20 or something like that. Okay, gotta get, make sure we get all these. And that's another thing, we need a water candle. That'll come in handy later. Did we get that? Or no? Nope. Okay. Put that away. Put that away. And that. Get that one, just in case. The more the merrier. Wow. Not having such great luck here. Found the mechanic though. It's pretty helpful. Don't kill there. Go oh, away. Yeah. Hurry up and talk to her before she dies. Jesus. And she died. Ow. 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 <laughs> yeah. Oh. Ha, dodged it. <laughs> Whew. I had to think on my feet there really. Oh god. This might be it. Gotta dodge that guy. There we go. Jeez. It's intense. Whew. Another potion. Let's see how far we can go. I definitely want to get this waterfall. I'm not leaving without it. Am 
might have to block this off, actually. Oh god. Oh god, please. Please. There we go. <laughs> Jeez. Like gotta be able to leave that chest there. Not let us. Do not blank us. Dude, what's in here? Ooh, Muramasa, sweet. Go find this. We will find it. There's no way we haven't found this thing yet. It's crazy. Aqua Scepter. Throw that painting away. Spelunker potion, my favorite potions. We have almost 10 gold now. Those. Ooh, dude. No way. Is that what I think it is? Obsidian shield? I think it is. I like that. <coughs> Soul shield emblem. No, go away. That's good stuff. That's loot. We need that. What is it? A cobalt shield. Oh, is this the one that reduces knockback? Please, please. Yes, it is. Immunity to knockback. That's so awesome. <laughs> It'll help out so much. We won't get, like, killed by chain hits as often. Bone welder? Used for crafting special crafting. Let's try to get all these guys in line. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. That damage. It's pretty awesome. It's like a... A mini golden shower, and I'm talking about the spell. <laughs> Ooh, deadly handgun, sweet. This is potion, go away. Ooh, blue moon, dude. Sweet, we don't need that anymore. Oh god. I would kill that thing before. Hits us. We got a blue moon. That is pretty awesome. We got a lot of new stuff from this guy. Damn, departed. Oh, uh. bastard, open the door. You guys see that? He's actually smart enough to open the door. Ooh, magic missiles. What you do, dude? Yeah, there's so much stuff in here. Don't need that anymore. We'll need grenades later. Water leaf seeds, I kinda wanna keep those too. Alright. Alright. I can't do it anymore. I've looked through like this whole dungeon and I'm gonna find it. We'll come back and do it, okay? I'll see you guys back at the base. Okay guys, we're back. We did not find the water bolt after all this time. Tome of water bolt. We didn't find it after all this time. Going through that frickin' dungeon. But we did find um, ancient necro helmet. We got some water candles, which will come in handy later. The, ag the agile magic missile, or magic missile. Handgun. Two of them, actually. One which uh, I'm probably going to be using. Um, Blue Moon, Aqua Scepter, and Gold Keys, which we'll need for something later on, too. Um, Clother Voodoo Doll, and a few other things which I threw away I didn't really need. Um, but yeah. And we also got a lot of gold, so we can add that to our stack. We almost have 40 gold now, it's not bad. But um, I think I'll end the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, leave anything you guys need in the comments, like, or just like, um, hmm, like constructive criticism, because I'm really trying to improve on my videos. So if you guys could say anything that I could improve on at any point, maybe an intro. I've been working on an intro uh, recently for my Terraria videos, so. Expect that sooner or later, within the next few episodes. But, uh, yeah. Like if you liked, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay nerdy, my friends.